Let's suppose you are in a situation that you need information from another actor or another object in your Unreal Engine project. In this case, for instance, I need the information from my cube, what it is. It says, I am a cube, it has a variable, uh, what am I? Uh, the same with the light, I am a light, what am I? And the same with our actor, what am I? I am an actor. Then you do some research and know that you have to cast to your actor in order to get the information. So far, so good. However, you come to the problem that you have to set something into the object wildcard and have no idea. You know what that circle is? That's the amount of people on YouTube that tell you to just get the third person character and then there's someone talking about whiskers or something, which is not useful at all when you want to cast to, let's say, this cube or this light, for instance. So how do you cast to something else than your third person character, which we all know by now how to do, get player character and pff, there you go. I'm going to go on a tangent real quick and try to explain to you what this object wildcard is and why we need it. Because you would say, I literally say cast to my blueprint that I need the information from. What else do you need? Unreal Engine, I literally told you the name of my blueprint. Well, it's the same as if you were to go to a friend and you go to him and say like, hey, I know you have Star Wars Episode 3. Can I have specifically Star Wars Episode 3? And he's like, sure, I have Star Wars Episode 3. However, do you need Lego Star Wars Episode 3 or do you need the movie Star Wars Episode? Do you need Episode 3 range of the Sifts on, on computer or any, any other games or do you need a book? There's a lot of Star Wars Episode 3 with the exact same name. Buddy, you need to be a bit more specific on what Star Wars Episode 3 you need. So we come back here and understand, oh, we need to tell Unreal Engine exactly what kind of blueprint JBoy 2 we need, but how do we know? Well, just click on it, go into the blueprint settings and see whatever is the parent class up here. Oh, seems like we need an actor reference. So we create a new variable and say it's, and it's an actor reference. Just go here, actor, actor, scroll down, object reference, perfect. Go in, get boy, plug it in, compile it first. It says good to go, uh, but does it work? So I got a couple of different examples here. The cube, the point light, and our J boy. I exposed all of these variables so that we can edit it right here. And you just have to figure out what everything is. A point light, for instance, is an actor as well. J boy is an actor as well. So we need to set actor reference and give him this information. Important though, it has to exist beforehand. Before you cast it, it has to exist, else it will fail. The cube, I did something else. For instance, I gave the cube a tag and said, all right, every actor with this specific tag is going into this object, which then says me, all right, what am I, what am I not? According to this logic, E, U und Ö, from German keyboard, will give me now my desired results, which will be play the level, I am a cube, I am an actor, and I am a light. Okay, this was obviously a very, very short click through video on what an object wildcard is and what you need to do. Let me know if you need a more detailed video about that with more specific instances and examples. And I hope I could help you and save you a lot of time and headaches.